I'm Jim Kinsler, Assistant Curator of the Aquarium Department at SeaWorld Orlando. I've been with SeaWorld for 19 years and I've had the opportunity to work with some really fascinating creatures. For example, my personal favorite, sharks. Did you know that they've been around for hundreds of millions of years and during that time they have changed very little, which means they are perfectly suited for the environment that they live in. Sharks are apex predators, which means they're at the top of the food chain and they fill such an important role in the environment. Sharks will consume all the ill, weak, and injured animals, which really helps to maintain the health and integrity of animal populations in our oceans. One of the most important things that we do for our sharks here at SeaWorld is to give each shark an annual physical. It is an invaluable part of what we do to monitor the health and well-being of our sharks. During these physicals, we'll take blood, we'll also take measurements, and we'll take the weights of the animal. We feed them between three and six percent of their body weight a week. Now that may not seem like very much, but what you have to remember is most sharks are cold-blooded animals, whereas like humans, we're warm-blooded. Therefore, we have to eat a lot of food in order to maintain a higher body temperature. You might be wondering, how do we feed all these sharks? Let's go behind the scenes and see how it's done. We're feeding sharks here at our main shark exhibit at SeaWorld Orlando. Today on the menu we have some herring, uh, mackerel, and blue runner. Whether it be for other animals or for people, you want to make sure they have a good variety of foods to choose from. Sometimes you have to grab the fish with the tongs in a certain position to give the sharks enough room to bite onto the fish. You want to make sure it's presented in such a way that they just go after the fish only. We know what each food item weighs, so therefore we're able to feed each shark the appropriate amount of food based on its body weight. What I'm doing here is once I feed out uh, a number of pieces of food to certain sharks, I'll go ahead and record that so I know exactly how much food I've given that shark. As you can see, it's a big job caring for sharks. Here at SeaWorld Orlando, you can get up close to over a dozen species of sharks, some even before they're born. Sharks are often misunderstood, but they're an important part of our oceans. The reality is shark species are in decline due to overfishing. It's all of our responsibilities to educate ourselves about how we can help protect them. To learn more about sharks, visit SeaWorld.org.